chapter two, jealousy. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? It feels the same to me. We got Josh, who is literally just Rami Malek. Like he just looks, <laughs> just looks exactly like him. Persistent, creative, and playful. Definitely persistent since he wanted to party like porn stars this Come on, year. Come grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. <laughs> hey guys. Get hey. Okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. Oh, he's so, so upset. What's up with him? So now I'm playing as Chris. Come yo, on, yo, Ash. Yo. Are you gonna you come? Things moving up here, or what? Yeah, man. Um, gossip. Um, let's just ask hey. if he's all right. You doing all right? I, mean, I know. Like, it must like be a normal friend would do. I just meant. To no, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it, and I just I want us to have a good time. You know. What do you mean you're I over it? Used to. Damn I get it. everyone grieves it's in their dead. own ways, though. I get it. I get it. I get it. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Being a, being a bit weird. But do we really gotta break into my yes. own place? Hi, Chris. Um, how how are you doing? So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. What about curled up against me? Right? Anyway, let me check this really, really, really quick. So, um... The soul of discretion. What is this? Ashley encouraged Matt to use the telescope. Mike saw, or Matt saw Mike and Emily flirting. Was it actually flirting though? Or was that just what it was perceived as? I feel like the game would be wise to misdirect us in that way to then cause some tension. But they also kind of made it obvious that like she wasn't actually going to go towards Sam. She was, she was going to him the whole time. So I don't have any regrets towards that. Just saying. What up, brother? Matt. Matt. It's been a while. Rough season, huh? Yeah. Something like that. So you and M. I'm just. I don't want to trigger him. I'm just gonna hey, ask how he's doing. Man. Some people, you know. You think you know him? Okay. 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 Walk away. Oh, see Nash yet? Um, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. cool. So far, that? Sam's my favorite. How's she doing? She's fine. Why? No reason. Does she have a crush on Chris? Nah, Sam. Sam, don't do that, Sam. Don't do that. I'm confused. I kind of like the drama, though. I love being outside of the drama. I don't want to be in it. Um, so this is kind of entertaining to me, but I also don't like to stir it up. Like if the drama comes to me, then it, then it comes to me. And then I'm like, right? I'm in it. She's okay. Like sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that Parker right off of and make some snow angels, right? Um, cut it out, bruh. Hey. Cut it out, man. That's weird. I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off? Relax. Right? Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Ew, you're yeah. a weirdo. I'm not feeding Listen, into me. this. Look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. 
You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Uh, I think everything should just work out as they should, no? Like, I'm not gonna force anything. I don't know, man. How can you not know? What if it's like weird? I don't wanna what force anything, that's so weird. Like, wanna be friends with me anymore if I try something like that. I mean, weren't you just listening? You gotta buck up, bro, grow up here. I mean, I guess if we both know that we have a crush on each other, I can maybe put on the riz a little bit more, but... I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. I also don't want to, like, put any expectations. I think as, like, a girl, that's, like, the worst thing that you can do is, like, put expectations. Why am I going this way? I'm supposed to go that way. You know what I mean? I think the worst thing for a girl is, like, when guys have these expectations and it like puts a lot of pressure those are wolves it puts a lot of pressure on it and i don't want to be that kind of guy because then it shows that all you care about is that gps i'm finally like outside where i might actually use it can you cool it on the phone talk what why it's pretty much all you talk about well you know i mean i could do all this stuff and well you got an app that can get us into the lodge nope got an app that can get you laid well, actually, Dude, there's this... you don't. The answer <laughs> is that you don't. The answer? You don't. Hmm. What is that? An axe holder that's been broken into. Wait, mystery man. So there's the wanted poster and then there's the... Oh, man. Oh, I have not found two other clues. Ooh. Got to keep an eye out for that. Um, any of your business is updated. What is that? Chris criticized Sam for being nosy. Okay, whatever. It's not deep. It's not that deep. Again, don't crucify me if I don't find every single little thing that I'm supposed to find. I am very new to this well, game. Well, we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Pushing it so we can get up there. Very graceful. Oh, I wanted to look outside a little bit more. I didn't know that was going to be my way in. I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing <laughs> up the rope. Whoa. Oh. Did I do that? What the I, heck? I don't think so. Here, use this. Nah, this is scary. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. Well, what, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and push. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. Oh, yeah, on the lock. All right, so you I was this. like, who am I going to use this on? Go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? I nope, guess so. Godspeed, Pilgrim. He's an interesting guy. I would never be friends with him IRL, but you know what? Chris seems to be a fan. What am I looking at? This looks like a generator. I'm just going to look in here. Go in there. Go in there. Can I not go in there? Oh my gosh. What is this? Ex-janitor convicted so for arson. Victor Milgram swears revenge on movie mogul's family. Victor Milgram, 52, is was yesterday sentenced to 16 years in prison for aggravated arson committed on Blackwood Pines. Milgram was employed as a janitor of the mountain's old hotel for 28 years. However, when Hollywood producer Bob Washington acquired the property, Milgram was fired. 
In a sensational twist, the sentencing ended with an enraged Milgram, Milgram screaming obscenities at Washington's heavily pregnant wife, Melinda, calling her a effing whore. He vowed to get all of you, your freaking husband and kids, and said that he would make them suffer. Melinda had visibly struggled to maintain her composure throughout the case and later claimed that though she was upset by Milgram's threats, she had full faith in the legal system to keep her and her family safe. Well, I doubt he's in prison right now. Is he not? So that was a clue. Good going, Ivy. Look at me. Is that a totem? Let's freaking go! Premonition. Ready? We go like this. Anything here? Oh, I found it! <laughs> Holy shit! Lost totem? Wait, was that Ashley? Uh oh. <laughs> Round. Okay, let's not. Let's not get the flamethrower then. Should we not? So. Does that mean if I go get the flamethrower, somebody's going to die? How do I... I don't know how to navigate... I don't know how to navigate the, like, death and lost ones because... <coughs> We're told of tragedy affecting friends. So something's going to happen with the flamethrower. Can I go in here? No. Oh, that's cool. Family portrait. That's a clue. A portrait of the Washington family. Hannah is wearing a distinctive locket. Cool, cool, cool. So we can maybe use that for identification sometime. Huh? Hello? What the hell was that? What the hell was that? Hello? I'm just gonna open... Is this the front door? I'm just gonna open it. We don't need the flamethrower. Is it really locked? Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. Hmm. It'd be nice if I could, like, not have to use the flamethrower. Where am I going? This is where I came from. Let's go this way. Where did he say it was? Like, in a backpack? Scouring the perimeter. What was that? Turn on the TV. No power. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Doesn't really help that I can't see shit. Can't see shit. Oh my God, I can't see anything. I hear some creaking. Where am I going? What is this? Oh, the remote. What is your message? Okay. Your message. Hi, Mrs. Washington. This is Sergeant Tate again. It's bad news, I'm afraid. Yeah, we've been he escaped. File, and there's nothing we can do. He's a free man. He's a free man. We don't have the legal power to restrict his movement. Uh, I know it's not what you wanted to hear, so call me if you want to know more. End of messages. Oh, he was never even convicted. Guys. Freaking great. He's gonna I'm gonna freaking die if I go upstairs. I'm gonna try to go in here. I can't go in here. I just gotta go upstairs. I 
I'm gonna look here first. Oh my god, it sounds so close. Prom night photo. Photo of Hannah, Sam, Mike, and Emily at the high school prom. Dude, that sounds so It's right above me. It's right above me. I'm gonna look down here first. When I'm sweating. I'm actually sweating. See if anything's here. All right, fuck it, I'm going. Oh, it's just a window that's open. It's just an open window. That's it. This house is freaking huge. Was that supposed to scare me? That didn't really scare me. The jump scare noises in this game are not that loud. Anything here? Anything here? Anything here? What's this? Also locked? Anything over here? I seriously freaking can't see. Let's go. Downstairs then, because there's nothing up here. Let's go downstairs. This guy better not be in the house. It foretold somebody else's death, not mine. So I think I'm fine. I think I don't really need to freak out. Hello, what is this? Oh, another family photo. Oh, I keep pressing the wrong one. Hannah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hannah, Josh. I can't see. Uh, I guess they, uh, wait, I already went down here. Where the freak do I go? What's my quest? Oh, go to the bathroom and find the deodorant can. Okay, where's the freaking bathroom? What's in here? Oh, I haven't looked here yet. Here's the bathroom. No, this is not the bathroom. Still can't see anything though. This is menacing. This is menacing music. Bathroom. Get me in there. This is a bathroom? It has a whole ass jacuzzi in it. Oh, is this not the bathroom? No, this is it. No, this is not. I guess this is the jacuzzi room. Oh, wait, no, it is the bathroom. Holy, I'm not rich enough for this. Let's go. Grab it. Holy. What the fuck was that? Perfect. We're freezing our buns off out here. What was that? Was that supposed to be like a raccoon? It looked much more rabid than that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. Oh my god. <laughs> Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was a just tiger? a cute little baby wolverine. <laughs> baby, don't worry, oh, buddy. Oh, a wolverine. Be a boy soon. All right, can we turn on some lights? My eyes hurt Home so freaking Home. bad. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. 
This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Oh my god, all intense. Get up at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Oh, Whoa. talk to your girl before you start you doing this, boy? dude. Um, I'm just gonna warn him. Mike, stay away from our girlfriend. Dude, what are you talking about? Stay away from Emily. Emily? Why would I want anything to do with Emily? Um, let's not, let's not. Right. I'm not gonna attack him. Right. What's going on with you, man? I gave him a little a warning and that's it. It's been a long day. Yeah. Well, try not to lose it again. No, nah, I don't want to like immediately kick off. He knows the warning though. Back off. Oh my God, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Um, I'm shut curious, up. Can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make a cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Is this... Is... Is this real? Chill out. Em, come on. No, shut up, Matt. Stay out of it, you dumb oaf. Hey, watch it. Oh, is this real? Can put him down. No one else can play with your toys. You're such a bitch. Whatever. Emily, you're the bitch. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0 bitch. Honor roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Dude, uh, hold on. Are we, are we adults? This is so weird. What the fuck? Like, what rational adults would do this? Like, the, I thought they were just like jesting, you know? And then, and then it just got real. I don't know. Tell Jess or tell Em to back the fuck off. Emily, stop. Shut your mouth, Jess. I'm Emily, you need to quiet up. Emily, stop. Quiet down. This is out of hand. There's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, yeah there is no em, reason. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Valid stop question. It. This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. Okay, if we can't get along for 10 minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah, yeah, all right. Emily's still just a jealous little do bitch. Any place without that whore. She's jealous and bitter. It's right up the trail. And still not over Mike. <sighs> Matt deserves over. better. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one or I Or maybe it's Rodeo. Emily that dies. Matt, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she what? was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Oh my god, she's such Why a headache. Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well. Do I'd... you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. She's such a headache. Can I hate her. Warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Shut up. Okay, let's go. She's so like, ugh. Ugh. I don't like her. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Sam's the best, still, by far. <laughs> Ugh! I hate girls like Emily. Like, chill the fuck out. 
Not everything's about you. Exiled. Like. Sexiled. Oh man, so entitled. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes. Love den. If we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right, and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars, you're gonna need these. Porn star? I Keys. Pay to see uh, gross. Ew, Josh. I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. Josh needs to get laid. So he can stop meddling with oh, other people's situations. Got to fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? Shut oh. up. Ew, these people are so gross. <laughs> these people are gross. Wait, let me look up here just in case. What is wrong with these people? How old are they? Totem. Don't tell me this is the death one. There we go. Okay. Danger. There's a lot of elk. So this is the danger one. So we're probably going to see some, uh... Yeah. So we're going we're gonna to have to make sure that we don't go near... Uh, I'm doing good on the clues so far. We don't go near... We don't go on the path with the elks. So when is he going to turn the generator on? Or maybe we're going to fight. We're going to find the elks anyway. And it's just letting me know like, yo, there's danger up ahead. You're going to encounter these elks. That's probably how it works. There's probably it's probably not like a foresight thing where I can hey, hot lips. avoid it. All right. Read my mind. So cute. Ready? One, two, three. Ready? Yeah. Look at the camera. Why aren't you guys looking at the camera? Gee. Uh, good effort. Next time. It's I not my fault. You weren't even day. looking. Well, okay, but it's not easy holding the thing all like backwards and forwards at the same time. <laughs> okay, let's go. I've got cabin fever. Okay. I don't even think I took a photo. Um Burr, it is Okay, we're going to have to be we're going to have to be ready. And how are you going to do that? We're going to have to be ready. Uh, I I don't know if I should use mind. my controller or if I should use my keyboard, but we'll, we'll see. We might need to make a sacrifice. What is that? Private property Washington estate. We might need to make a sacrifice. We'll see though. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Right. Maybe if we're True lucky, that. try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. Um, she was. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Epic. Suck it. Epic. I don't know how soon their relationship you know, ended, but get over it. Okay, light All it up. All right, let's see. Boom. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Yeah. Cool. Woo, you are a wizard. Oh! Wah -ha -wah -ha 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 -ha. Anything in here? Uh oh. Okay, the elk might not be the only dangerous thing on this path.
Oh my freaking gosh. Kazam. The gates. I'm scared. Don't go so far ahead. Don't go so far ahead. Yeah. Totally. No, this is awesome. Oh yeah. I bring the hits. She's so fun. Stop walking by yourself. What are you looking at? You psyched yet? No, I'm fucking you don't freaked. Look psyched yet? I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. How are you? How are you even thinking about sex in this weather? Freezing my booty and biddies off. How far is this guest cabin? Why is it so far? Police tape. From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. What do you remember? What do you mean, what do you remember? It's also too I barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank. So she was there. We got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean... It's not our fault they ran into the woods. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? That's... You guys did the dumb thing. But whatever. Whatever, whatever. Dude, I'm fucking... I'm freaked. I'm so freaked. What if that guy was trying to... S Hear that? What was that? I heard something. Yeah. Dude, I think there's some like supernatural things out here. Like, there's no way Damn. these things are normal. They look I like. Think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh no way! Oh. Am I going back to the lodge, aka Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily? Anything right there? No. You know what? Um, I have a feeling there's some like alien Romulus type another way <laughs> monsters coming. What the hell is this? Is this a mine? Ah! Ah! Yes! Fuck. You stupid. Hey, Jessica. Yep. Hey. Um. Okay. Whoa. Oh, she's up. Crap! You scared the heck out of me. I didn't think I felt. Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> seven. Uh, yeah. Did you get out? Uh, what is that noise? I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Um, push, let's, let's, we don't need to rush. All right, Jess, there's a cart. I think if you can push it, you can get by. All right. Okay, let me just try. Okay, no. It's too heavy. Um, squeeze through the gap? Why try again? She didn't do it the first time. Hey, so, babe... You see the little gap down there? Between the cart and the wall? The tiny little gap? Yeah, maybe you can just, you know, like shimmy through it or something. <laughs> I appreciate your confidence in my physique, but I don't think the ladies are gonna fit. Oh. Oh. With the, right, okay. Right. Gotcha. Right. Okay, so. Why don't you either toss that light down or, you know, be a hero and jump down here to assist me? Yeah, no. Mm, I don't know if I should really go down there because like, what if, what, what if like, we, this is not the way to go and we need to like leave. I don't know. Do I jump down there and help her? Do I drop the light? And I'm just cautious and careful. This might be another situation where I get both of us killed or I get one of us killed. If I go down there, she can't even get past the cart though. So like, what is she going to do? If I go down there and we push the cart together, then we can go through. Because what is she going to do without? Yeah, I'll go down. Don't move. I'm coming in. Better hurry. What's the status update? I'm fucking scared. You know what? No, 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 no. 
I'm not gonna look yet. I'm not gonna look yet. Hey, handsome. Wanna help me move okay. this cart thing? Just making sure there's nothing over here. Yeah. Yeah, because what are you gonna do by down here by yourself? Right? I need to help you out. Help me, bitch. I mean, babe. <laughs> I would never in a million years go jump down to a mine together with anyone ever. This is the stupidest thing you could ever do. Jump down a mine, mine shaft. The stupidest thing. Okay. Okay. Oh shit! Oh shit! I hit the wrong one. Oh I hit. Gosh, are you okay? Damn it! I hit Y on the Xbox, but X on the Switch. Lovely. I need to look down. <laughs> oh god, you totally ate shit. Thank you. It's fine. Still got my teeth. I'm fine. I just took a little spill. Yes. I'm okay. Nothing bad happened. Wait, what if I go down here? This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. Is there any clues? Right here? Comfort <gasps> Totem! Oh my god, this might be the death one. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Blue? Holy! Fortune? How is that a fortune? Dreams of luck and fortune? That does not look... Maybe she's fortunate to be alive? Maybe she's about to almost die and then... But she's... she's fine? She'll be fine? What the fuck was that? That was fast. That was real fast. And she was also kind of naked, so maybe we prevent any sexy time from happening and then she might like not hurt. She might not get hurt. I still don't know how these premonitions really work. Oh shit! Whoa. This place? Oh shit! This is Future Ivy here. I did not find this in my original playthrough, but I'm finding it now. What the freak? Yeah, is that cheating? I don't know. But I'm doing it. I was just kind of gonna let that cigar bud fly, but now I'm like stumbling upon all of this. This is insane. So no, this is my this is my reaction. Oh my god. Um it's faceless reaction, but it's reaction nonetheless. That's this is what I'm finding um, that past Ivy did not find. Yay! This is like historical. Holy bat cave! I don't know American, right? if I would I think describe it as on, no. historical. Yeah, this definitely like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Um, Satan? I don't think this looks historical. I think this is like, it's very possible that this is like in real time. How did I miss this the first time? Anyway, back to, back to myself. But that was the, that was that, oh my God. That was that specific one. Yeah, close one. I don't think this place is up to code. No, this is the worst idea. Time to go. Go where? You want to leave? No, we're going through, baby. Jesus. Oh, a danger map. A map showing structural faults in the mine marked with a mine engineer. Looks like the owners knew there was a risk of collapse. Well, I can't read this whatsoever, so we're just gonna... Hope that we don't go in the... a real fixer rubber. Danger zone. 
Let's just hope that we don't go in the danger zone. Oh my god, I hate this. <laughs> I hate this point of view. Okay, let's go. A little ray of hope. Not bad. We did it. Oh my god, I would start running. I can't. Cool, we're here. Nothing over here, nothing over here. Okay, let's go. Maybe the premonition's just got me like freaking out for no reason. I'm kind of, like, I'm so, I'm so on edge. I don't know when they're gonna happen. Well, well, when Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Like bedroom. Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Also, what does that mean? Take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, buddy. Oh, a telescope. Ooh. Gonna look at the trees. Gonna look at the clouds. Gonna look at the cabin. What? Whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. You saw someone? Okay. Let me see. What do you mean you saw someone? <laughs> Holy! Sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. I... Oh, my time ran out. No, there's definitely someone there. I'm gonna look again. I don't see anyone. Okay, just making sure. Just making sure. Someone is definitely there though. The suspense is killing me. There's no way one of us is not dying tonight. But then I would have found the death totem. There's the elk. Which path? Maybe we not take that path? Oh my God. Watch out bird brain. <sighs> Just, just answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah, got a lot of love to give. <laughs> Are we sure we go that way? Can I not go this way? <gasps> oh my god, I'm finding so many totems, guys. Oh my god. Oh my. I am finding them. Oh, this is the death one. This is the death one for sure. The, another lost one wait so is there no way to prevent it i'm just she's gonna okay where she's gonna fall she's gonna fall somewhere and i'm oh, babe babe you're gonna fall somewhere and i'm not gonna be able to save you probably Maybe the premonition is just preparing me for what's going to happen. I need to stop thinking of ways that like maybe I could prevent it happening. It's probably just like showing me that it's going to happen so I can like Damn prepare. It, Josh, wouldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Oh, boo. Show off. Careful. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Don't fall. Oh. Okay. Okay. That's how it's gonna be. Where'd she go? Jess? Jess? 
Hello? Where'd she go? You can't do that to me! He's gonna make some, yeah, he's gonna make a comment like that. Hardy hard. Um. Come on. Oh, man, what if she fell right, and died? Josh, I'm so confused. Josh? Okay, really quick, we're gonna check. Because I think it's really fun to like, look at these. So be her hero. Mike, Mike came to Jessica's aid reluctantly. Jessica didn't appreciate Mike's reluctance to help. That was not, don't get it twisted. You've definitely got it twisted. Matt sided with Jessica during the fight with Emily. I did because Emily started it. Like, she could have just walked in the room, minded her own business, but no, she's jealous and bitter and had to start a fight and just be a brat. So, yeah, I started with Jess. Let's go. God, imagine having a bathtub that big. Wow. That's awesome. Again, I hate being in this house. It's so freaking dark. Whoa. What was that? What was that? What was that? I don't know why I'm just thinking about this, but let me know down in the comments if uh, if you would ever want to be like a, a character in this game and if you would want to be with me. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Let me rephrase that. If you, if you would want to be with me in a situation like this, would I get you killed or would you feel like I'm smart enough to like maneuver? <laughs> That's my question, basically. Oh, I found one. Oh, God. I don't know if I've seen this one before. Guess what, baby? I freaking have because when I played this again, I freaking picked it up as Chris because I'm just, I, I just love to mess up. I love to make everything so hard on myself. I enjoy it so much. So here's me figuring that out. And then we're going to go do a little side quest because you guys will enjoy this one. I know you will. And it, it's, it's not cheating. It's not cheating. I'm still playing the game. This is just so, I just hate, I hate this. We'll come back though to the premonition after this little side quest, I promise. I promise. And no other video will be like this one because this has been absolute torture. Anyway, bye. Oh, it was cause I already found this one. It's cause I already found this one. It's cause I already found it, that's why. Also, I noticed that I, I didn't go and look in here, which, okay, I'm cheating again. I'm cheating again. But it's like, it's like, come on. I know, come on. Would you guys rather me kind of like actually look in here? I, I just missed it on the first time. I promise I won't ever cheat again, but like, come on. Okay, hold on. Let's look at this really quick. Um, Hannah, Josh, and Beth, you're invited to Sam's Halloween party on October 21st, 2013. Fancy dress obligatory. Um... I know this is technically cheating, but I freaking lost my gameplay. Okay, freaking lost it. I deserve a little bit of cheating. I freaking lost it. Tattoo. Oh yeah, that's probably where Hannah got that really horrific tattoo. I'm sorry, Hannah. I'm sorry, girl, I love you, but that tattoo is not it. Cause look at all this stuff. Yeah, look at all this stuff. It's obviously fitting for Sam to be in here. He's saying I was my best friend. Aww. Aww, Josh got her this. 2010. So sweet. And what else? Oh, so this was ex exclusively Hannah's bedroom, I think. Yeah. Um, dear Hannah, I would be delighted. Oops. Gee, Hannah. Oh, that's a picture Crush of Matt. Much? Or, uh, Mike. Mike. 
Potato, potato. Hold on, let me read this real quick. I didn't even get to read it. We'd be delighted if you want to join our party. Um, at 7 p.m. at the location of Casa de Mike. Okay, so it was Mike's party. And gosh, it, okay, I'm going to be honest. It was a little bit weird to see how into Mike Hannah was even when he and Emily were like obviously a thing. What is this? Huh. Hello, could this be any more about Mike? Mike, see, you know what? I think that's a little bit weird, especially if like Mike and Emily were kind of exclusive. I mean, it kind of looked like it, maybe they weren't, but like, you know, you don't go, you don't go throwing yourself at a guy that's like clearly obviously with somebody else. That's just weird. That's weird on Hannah. Um, and if that's not how it actually was, then I would love to, you know, be corrected, but it, that's what it seems like it was. So anyway, I, I like that I, that I took a, took a little looksy loo of the room. That looks like a black abyss, but it's a freaking closet. I can't see anything. Um, now back to, uh, future Ivy and her sad attempt at sinking this gameplay and it's not very, it's not going very well. Probably the death one. Fuck. <sighs> oh, the guidance. Fuck. <sighs> so when I go to the bath, I'm going to freaking need some guidance. Okay, I'm going to need Fuck. to go <sighs> in the dumb waiter. I don't want to go in the dumb waiter. Fuck. Is that a dumb waiter? Is that like a, I don't know. Anyway. It's showing me a lot of stuff, like, it's showing me that shit's gonna get real, but nothing's getting real yet. Hello? Oh, hey, I can't see anything. Wait, let me go this way. Oh, there's no stairs or whatever, okay. Totally. Okay, for Sam, when I take a bath, prepare. Prepare, prepare, prepare. I checked up here with Chris. Is there nothing up here again? With Sam? Okay, yeah, I don't think so. I don't know if I have to check the area like again okay. with each well, person, but I doubt it. Somewhere in this crazy place, we used to have a I called oh, it. I called yeah, it. Yeah, Those things are a joke, man. I don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time. Me and... Well... Hey Josh, no hot water's kind of a major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um... Okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? I guess so. Where are we going? Um, Josh makes me a little uncomfortable, guys. I'm not gonna lie. Just a wee bit. I hope I didn't miss anything up there. I'm assuming that I don't need to check too much again. Hey, you notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, you're so yeah, slick. I was thinking they could use some alone time. <laughs> yeah. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. For real. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over you know some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms i mean at this immediately rate, resorting to trauma before chris makes a move immediately resorting to trauma okay i have a feeling i might have missed something i'm just gonna go you know sam yes josh i just wanted to say what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that 
You came, Sam. Um. Yeah. Um. I'm. I'm gonna be uneasy. I'll, I'll, I'll be honest. It's definitely weird being back here, but I think it'll help us all put everything behind us. Yeah. Um. I want us to have a good time, you know. Yeah. I'm surprised he has not put the moves on me. Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle. I don't have a flashlight. Set of stairs. Mm -hmm. I don't have a flashlight. I can't see where I'm going. Like for real? Holy! Okay. What was that? Oh, that was him. Any little little speck of light, I'm like, whoop. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know. Well, right. It's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Yeah. Is that so like That's so bad? Baseball bat. Um <laughs> baseball in the snow. Be pretty rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, dad, my sisters, it was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality. Right, Sam? Right. Anyway, Sorry. I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Is it working? Here, can you... Can you hold this? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Yeah, what the hell was that? What do you mean, what was that? What was what? Okay, ready? Yank it. Yank it. Nice one. Hell yeah. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Oh, damn. It's okay. I'm mean, just try again. Did I not do it? Okay. There. Not that hard. Just press the button. Oh, the when light the light comes, comes on. on. Okay, okay, okay. I'll get it this time. When the light comes on. Okay. There. Whoa. How was I supposed to know that? More like it. <laughs> All right. All right, oh, shit. That was fast. And again, I pressed the wrong one because I... Instinct makes me do the Xbox. Fuck! Just, just joshing. At least I missed just a hand or a high five. Oh, you were really freaked out. I'm gonna prank him. Oh my god. Don't move. What? Something behind you. Yeah, right. Josh. I'm a little it's prankster. Really I'm a little prankster. There's something back there. Oh no, this is not. <laughs> this is not gonna be good because he's not gonna listen to me next time. Holy no. What? No. Where'd you get the first point? Doesn't start at 30? No, 15. Oh. Oh. More of a ping pong now. 
I kind of ship them now. What? Okay, so you hear that too, right? I changed my mind so fast. Josh. What? Ty said he's like weirdly regular. No, not nothing regular about it. Uh oh. We should check it out. Maybe we should check it out. We should check it out. Why? What if it's like a a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Okay. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh, it's pointing to that spot it always pointed at. Holy shit, B. Oh, thank goodness I didn't miss that. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Go. Holy shit. There's a stranger in here, though. Hey. Is that hey. fucking Matt? What the hell? Oh, you just got mucked. It's Chris. What? <laughs> nice, nice one. That was good. Dude, what? I'm like so. Why no. Why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was Dude. I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. That's so not funny. I'm ready to admit that you're dumb little. I'm tired of these spooky pranks and the darkness. I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Okay, we all got our pranks out. Let's not do it again. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. I totally did. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay. Okay, <laughs> did you at least find the thingy? Oy, 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 oy. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Mm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. Yeah. Bye-bye. Right? So Oh, have watch fun. out for that Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Why do I kind of like her and Josh together? I find Josh really weird, but I don't know. Their vibe is really good. I'm so... I would not survive in the pre-electricity era. I'm so tired of the darkness. Oh, Let's freaking... Turn on yeah. some lights, yeah, please. Turn on some lights. Ugh, and then I don't, I don't even want to be... I don't even want to be with her. I'm going to be with her... Uh, I need to really I, R or not R. Um, why is really screwing me up on my actions? Are, madam. Why, why is that you, one? Sir? Why is that one? X is up here. Why is there? X is there. Okay. Hey, M. Yeah. Let's start over. I don't want to. Should start the weekend over. I don't want to. Right now. Do Clean this. Slate. Oh. No arguing. No Mike. No Jess. Just you and me enjoying ourselves and all this nature. Oh, you mean oh natural? Damn straight. I can get with that. Cool. So stop being a bitch. That's basically what I'm saying. What's over here? Binoculars. What am I looking at? Swing. Down. Oh, a flashlight. Okay, no people. There's a flashlight down there. Okay, okay. Why did you stop? I wonder if I'm going to find. Oh! Okay. Holy. All right. They just turned on the generator. It's fine. Uh, 
I was gonna say, I wonder if I'm gonna find a totem for her death. Oh, we're going that way. Hey, doofus, come this way. What if I don't want to? Um, I'm not flirting. I don't want to flirt. I don't know if it's a good idea to leave this path here. Don't be a puss. Come on, it'll not be being worth a... it. You'll see. How about I go this way? I'm gonna go any other way. Wait, let me let me pick up the flashlight here. Can I pick it up? Where is it? Right here. Oh, I can't pick it up. No way. Oh, I found a... Ew. I thought this was a totem. You okay? No totems? Nothing over here? What if I try to leave her? Bye-bye. That's weird. No way. For real? For real? Oh, shoot. Crap, now I gotta go with her. I came back. Oh, I gotta go with my own girlfriend. Obey. I don't want to. Oh, yay. Don't molest me, please. What? Yeah. Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. A little. No problem. It's no problem, babe. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. He's kind of a golden retriever, you know? Up. All day. <laughs> what? All day. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Wait, he's a like, golden retriever boyfriend. Long. I was being, like, sexy. You really didn't understand that, girl? It's not... It's not that uncommon of a saying. I'm, like, shocked that I haven't found a totem yet with him. I'm shocked I haven't predicted Emily's death yet. <laughs> it's basically what I'm saying. Huh. Cool. I told you guys, she's probably gonna live the longest. out here tonight wow yeah it's so nice to be here with you muscle man uh, i'm not all muscle there are some brains in here too well you got enough brains to like me so let's see that brawn you ever done it outside before in the outside snow what? my car i like your car roomy this ain't roomy enough for you there's- you're kidding yourself if you'd be able to get it up in the snow. Uh, I mean, I'm not a guy, so... Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this off for us. Like a gentleman. Oh, come on, let's look around. Outside? Outside? Ugh. Sorry, but how could he even... Hi, you know what? Not gonna question What's it. So important in the bag, anyways. It's just my undies, the lacy ones. Oh, why didn't you say so? Well, why didn't you say we were scooping up such precious cargo? On the lay, on the lay. <laughs> Whoa, Nelly didn't realize it was so important to you. Didn't did, uh? uh no, no, hello. Why do you think I'm even on this silly trip? Okay. Yes, well, this is totally how you how you get your girlfriend to sleep with you. When I want. Duly noted. Not a secret. True fact. Totally. Oh, there's a totem right here. A big one. Oh, this is the one we saw this when we came up here, right? This thing dared put your hand in it. Day, hey, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. Guess I'll be the big Emily. boy and rescue. Emily. <laughs> I'll be the big Got guy. Yeah. Oh, come on. 
Uh, oh, I'm not sure. That does not sound human. An Do you not like that? Did not sound human. Is it this way? No. It is that way. Freak. Here you are, madam. Thank you. I wanted to go the other way to oh see if my. I can find a totem. Very impressive. Can I turn around? <gasps> I cannot. Crap. I didn't get to investigate the other way. It's fine, though. What's up here? Is this their cabin? This is also not going to work, huh? <laughs> yup. This is a long walk. It's a very long walk. What, are you waiting for me? Oh! What hey. on earth? What the hell? Somebody made a snowman. Uh, that was not there before. Is that a note? Oh my gosh, welcome oh. back. Uh, That's freaky no. Chris or Josh, they're just trying to mess with us. That's not I my immediate assumption. Guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. Yeah, same, let's go. Oh, okay. Man, they're just leaving us on cliffhangers. Hmm. Oh, you're freaking weird. I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Oh, you're... Oh. Do I share this fear? Probably. Oh, so he, he's got gore and he's got snakes there. What does that question even mean? Do you share this fear? Oh, like, have I said it before to people? Probably not. Probably no. not. Then how do you feel about people who are afraid? How do I feel about people who are afraid? Um, I feel sympathy. I see. Well, it's okay to be afraid. Fear of isolation. Do you feel pity for him? Not. I mean, sympathy and pity aren't necessarily the same thing in my mind. So I don't really, Mike. Not really. Indeed. That is apparent from the choices you made. I don't know what you're trying to do, dude. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, he probably knows my mind better than me. That is apparent from the choice that I made. I don't care about Mike being alone. And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Uh oh. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Loyalty or honesty? I feel like I value loyalty over honesty. I get why sometimes people have to lie and I get why sometimes people don't want to be honest about some things, but as long as they are still real with me and loyal, I think I'm fine with that. I think I value loyalty more. So you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? Charity? I don't... 
I don't really know See, about. Do it sooner. Look after your friends before caring for those in great need. Oh, is that what that meant? I I didn't know what that meant. Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. I I didn't know what that meant. I think if you ask the questions a little bit like st more straightforward and digested them a little bit more or like dissected them, then I would probably know what he meant. Anyway, let's um, end on there. So yeah, we're leaving off there. Um, play chapters one and two. We'll continue. We'll do two chapters probably per episode. This game was so much fun. I am, I'm honestly having like a really fun time. It's stressful, but like also not. And it's not too intense for me yet. So I, I do like that. I think it's very interesting. I think the therapy sessions are like really cool. It's a really cool way to like break down kind of what your decisions were and kind of like, I don't know, read into it a little bit more psychologically because sometimes we're just like, boom, and we just act. And it's like cool to think about it a little deeper, you know? So far, I'm still figuring out the game. So um, next time I think we'll, I'll, I'll get the hang of it a little bit more, but I honestly think I'm doing a pretty good job at like finding things and like figuring out the totems maybe. I mean, that's the one thing that I'm a little confused about still, but so far I'm pretty happy with how I'm doing. So um, let me know how I'm doing in the comments and your thoughts. And remember, no spoilers though. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Bye.